what's up YouTube? I decided I'm not going to wait until Friday. So I'm going to give you guys four professional basketball NBA game game prediction matchups for the NBA playoffs. Now, you do understand that it's not until August 17th. There are still basketball games being played tomorrow. So when I upload these tonight or tomorrow morning, it's most likely going to be tonight going into tomorrow. Don't be, be like, oh, man, the NBA playoffs is on Saturday and Sunday. No, there are some basketball games being played all throughout tomorrow to finish the NBA season. Some NBA teams like the Lakers already finished their season. So there's still some matchups tomorrow. But it don't start until August 17th. And the Saturday and Sunday coming up is like two days where there ain't going to be no basketball. And then out of nowhere, Monday, it's basketball again, but it's the time for the NBA playoffs. So I decided I want to make these ahead of time. So when the NBA playoffs start, you already know what I think about the predictions that are set. Now, it's going to be the Milwaukee Bucks versus the Orlando Magics. This is going to be very competitive, okay? This is one of those make-or-break series. This is going to show why the Milwaukee Bucks got the number one seed in the East. Um, they're bigger, they're stronger, they're faster. They can play four quarters of a basketball game. They got a good backcourt. They can run in transition, but their center, their center got exposed last um, season when they played the Toronto Raptors. And every time they always get to the playoffs, they're always stopped by one team, and that is the defending NBA champions, the Toronto Raptors. Now, the Bucks can win this series depending on playing offense. They're, not offense, defense. They're by far the most defensive basketball team in the NBA, so their strongest strength is their defense. If they can play defense, they can finish the series and four games or you know four games or less. Now the only way I can see Milwaukee lose Game One and the rest of the series if they just don't play no defense and no offense and they don't attack the basket. So that means if they don't put up no twenty points a quarter, um, then they're gonna lose this. They're gonna lose Game One and they're gonna lose the series. Now Milwaukee Bucks can win games at home and on the road, so that's the good thing. And they can win a series. So that's the good thing. The only thing is, you're going against the Orlando Magics in the first round. And they're going to have to play basketball. That's just all there is to it. I think Milwaukee wins game one, 110 to 105. Or Magics win 107 to 105. It's not just going to be no blowout in this basketball game. Like, you can do that in the season, in the preseason. This is the NBA playoffs. Come August 17th, um, these two teams are going to meet in the Orlando Bubble Arena, and these teams are going to trade shots back and forth. So it's going to be the first two quarters. It's going to be fun and entertaining. And then the third and fourth quarter, it's going to get so physical, so competitive, that there's going to get fouls, technical fouls. You know, because it's going to be that physical. This is a make-or-break series. If Milwaukee Bucks beat Orlando Magics in Game 1, you should know the rule. Whoever wins Game 1, 99.99% of the statistics, wins the series and goes on to the NBA Finals in the East or in the West. But if we're going to a new system for the NBA playoffs, which you can tell it's still the same system because... We're doing East versus East, and then we're doing West versus West. Like, I'll do the West Conference maybe Saturday, maybe Friday night or Saturday, so the videos are not too close together so you guys can get a chance to get some breathing space because I don't want to do the videos in the East and the West all at once because that's like four matchups, eight videos. And I don't want to do all the videos that fast, that quick. And you'd be like, man, you ain't, NBA season ain't even over yet, Alex. Well, Tomorrow's like the last day for the remaining teams. Most of the teams already had their season, and they want to get back and get ready for the playoffs. So I think Milwaukee Bucks takes game one. It's going to be 110 to 105, or Magic's win game one, 107 to 105. So that's going to be for that matchup. 